Hey guys, today's video is going to be my Ipsy bag unbagging. Let's open. The theme for this month is unzip. So this is how the theme of the month card looks like for this month of February 2018. And then on the back of it, it says show your sexiness off, meaning show your look with all the products on I don't know I might do it but so this is it um I don't know who these people are but they all gather up for this month Ipsy the theme is unzipped yeah so anyways let's see how the bag looks like for this month of February 2018 this is how the bag looks like for this month of February 2018. So, going close up, it has a lace on the front and it's like a light pink on the bottom. This is so elegant. This is an elegant Ipsy bag for this month of February 2018. I absolutely love this so much because like if I'm going out to a wedding, to a party or whatnot, this is very fancy to take with me to put my makeup inside, inside my purse. This is great. I love this so much. I love the way that they created this Ipsy bag for this month of February 2018. Is this bag is so gorgeous. I love the lace. Okay, so the first thing I see in my Ipsy bag is Pacifica Beach Crystals Natural Mineral Eyeshadow is 100% vegan and cruelty free. So this is it, how it looks like in the package. And then you slide it down and this is how it looks like. So the shades is purple, browns, and a light purple. It's like a mix of everything. So I'm going to open this right now. Let's see if I can open this. Okay, so... These are the colors, so it's like a light purple, like, um, wait, I don't know what color purple, I think this is like a soft purple, no, this one is soft, I don't know what kind of purple that is, but it has browns and it has this like, um, copper brown right here, so pretty, I can't wait to play with these in a minute, so Let's swatch these because I want to definitely want to know if it's pigmented or not pigmented. So let's put this baby out to the test. Okay, so I'm swatching it. So by swatching it, it feels very chalky and it's not pigmented at all. Nothing is really coming out. Look at this. I just swatch all of them and look at it look how like light it looks it's not pigmented it's super light um i just don't really like this at all it is so light and you see the color's not even coming out very strong on my hand so personally i don't like this at all and plus it's very chalky it's not creamy ipsy bang that goes along to apply this eyeshadow. So, let's see. Okay, so the next product that I got, and it's like pretty obvious that I know what it is. So, it's um, Luxie Beauty. Luxie Beauty, it's like a duo eyeshadow brush. So, this is Luxie Beauty. 249 dual eye brush so this is a crease brush right here crease brush right here and this side is a shadow brush so the number is 249 this is 249 eye dual brush 
Um, personally, I personally love Luxie Beauty brushes. Why? Luxie Beauty brushes are very soft. I had no problems with Luxie Beauty brushes. Their bristles as they come off. It is absolutely amazing. So I'm going to take this brown shade right here for my crease using the brush that I just showed you guys. Okay, so next thing I'm going to do on my crease is this huh, is this light purple right here. This is like a pastel purple. I'm going to put that in my crease. Look at this. It is not pigmented. Oh my god. Okay, so since the purple is not coming out very pigmented, I'm just going to play with this one, this color purple right here and see if something comes out. It is very chalky and it's not pigmented. Okay, guys, so this is all that I could do because, as you can see, I am struggling with this eyeshadow palette by Pacifica. Usually, normally, Pacifica is a good brand, but their eyeshadows, I don't know what's going on with the eyeshadows, but anyway, so I sprayed the shader out of the brush because not pigmented so I'm going to take this color right here it's like a like a copper orange look that's what I'm gonna use for all over my eyelid And another thing about these shadows, they are so light. Look at this. I put it on my eyes and you can hardly see it. Oh my god. Wow. But let's see what else inside this bag for this month of February 2018. So the next thing I see is pure fully charged mascara so this is pure cosmetic fully charged mascara this mascara oh my god i heard so many reviews about this i personally love pure cosmetics but the only thing i don't like about pure cosmetics is like they like to copy from other companies i had told you in the past what well, 
that they copied. If you guys don't know who Carly Bible is, Carly Bible came out with her first eyeshadow palette and then all of a sudden Pure Cosmetics created one that's called Solidary Diaries. It looks exactly like her palette. It has like the marble marble theme on it and it has her colors in the palette so i don't know what they're trying to do i love pure cosmetic but i personally don't like when you copy other people work so but anyways pure cosmetic is a wonderful high-end branded products are so good it's amazing i used a product before um yeah, so I really don't remember how much this mascara was. So, um, I believe this is a black mascara because I only use black mascaras. And the wand, look at the wand. Brush head wand. It's so fluffy. I love brush head mascara ones that is fluffy because the fluffy the wand is, the more volume your lashes will be with it even if like you don't want to apply falsies you just want to go out with no fall you just want to relax because i know falsies can be bothered for some people because a lot of people that wear falsies have a hard time keeping it on their eyes for a long time so this is always have a like a super volume mascara that will like pop your lashes up i absolutely love doing that i always do that all the time when i don't want to apply my falsies so anyways enough to chatting now let's try this on I love it. It made my lashes pop. Okay, so this is how it is. Look how my lashes are with this pure, fully charged mascara. Oh my god, look how it made my lashes. It is so volume oh my god is so pretty right? okay so the next thing i see in my bag is mellow cosmetics matte liquid lip paint the shade i got is tyron so this is a this is how it looks like it's by mellow cosmetic it's a matte lip paint so pretty i love this like a nude brown color, like a light brown color. Love that shade so much. So I'm gonna swatch it right now. Wow, it's so pretty. Look at this. Look how pretty. So pretty. I love, this is my favorite shade, like nude. I love like nude brown shades and I like mauve colors. I like red liquid lipstick too, but it can't be like extremely red. It has to be like a soft red, like something like very pretty, but this one I love so much. So, as you can see, this is super pigmented. I love it. I have no problem. It's not streaky at all. So, personally, I love it so far. So, let's apply this on me. Okay, it's on, so I'm going to zoom in. You can see, so pretty, right? Such a beautiful brow, look at this. So pretty, but with this eyeshadow, mm -mm. 
Hey, so last and final product that I have in this bag for this month of February 2018 is Bubble Macaroon Lip Balm. It says essential oils, bath and body. So this is a macaroon. I don't know if you heard that before. Macaroon, macaroon is like a, like a, I don't know how to say it. It's like a cake and a cookie at the same time. They have different kinds of this. Oh my God. They taste so delicious. When I was in culinary school, Oh my gosh, I used to like when I go to the bakery, I tried to, they have pistachio, they have so many, pistachio I love, they have so many other kinds that are so good, I tried them so much. Um, personally, when I was in culinary school, I didn't learn how to make these, but I, they, um, the, my chef, she took us to the bakery, all these bakeries in Manhattan, and I we get to try all different kinds of macaron, and they are delicious. They're like a combination of a cookie and a cake, because you know how cookies are like this small, and then it's also like soft, like a cake. It's like it's like mix in between. But I personally love this so much. It is amazing macaron. So, this is a lip balm from, it is from the UK. Personally, I thought this was one of those Korean beauty products because they, you know how they're Korean beauty products, they come up with weird stuff. So, but anyway, this is a macaroon lip balm. It smells good. It smells like very fruity. It has a fruity set. Love it. I'm not going to try this on. Maybe I will. No. I'm not going to try this on because I already applied the liquid lipstick. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give this video a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe right here. And if you are new to my channel, hi, I'm Trina. Welcome to my channel. If you enjoyed this video, if you want to see more videos from me, all you have to do is click my username down below right there and it will take you directly to my channel page which i have filmed and posted up a lot of fun videos the videos that i have posted if you guys want to know i have posted up make tutorials skin care lip swatches hair videos and more so please check them out and don't forget to subscribe to see new videos every tuesday and friday and another extra thing that i gotta tell you if you subscribe to my channel don't forget to click the bell button because if you don't click the bell button i know i don't like talking about this in every single video but i have to because youtube is not letting people know and not only me other youtubers even famous youtubers have to do this so i have to say this too that you have to click the bell button on my username when you subscribe so you get notified for new videos for me every tuesday and friday and that will let you know that i post a new video so if you don't do that you will not know that i post a new video i'm sorry i don't like saying this in my videos but like i said i have to youtube is not doing that no more not doing the the old-fashioned way no more when when you subscribe you see the new video of a person mm -mm. youtube not there no more so don't forget to subscribe thumbs up and i'll see you in my next video